Again! Oh. Ah. Oh. Well, Ruslan and Glenroy's katana really have saved me there. Oh. Ha 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 ha. Second werewolf of the day. Yikes. He didn't bite me, did he? I don't think so. I oh, killed a couple of deer, though, and a fox. Actually, uh... Well, at least I'm back here. This is really close to Bruma. Eh. I should really tell somebody about that werewolf problem. Oh, right, the guard tower is up here. Presumably, there's a guard, also. Let's find out, shall we? Last time I came up here, I didn't hear anybody. Or see anybody. Hello? Excuse me? Anybody home? Hello? Presumably this tower is manned. Anybody there? Huh. Well, here's somebody. Oh, hello. Garrison, um, we're Bruma's first line of defense. Got to be on alert. Always on alert. Yes. Um, uh, I would like to report a crime, actually. And you have a bit of a werewolf problem around here. I'm not sure if you were oh, aware. What crime? Go ahead, citizen. Well, a, uh, a smuggling ring tried to blackmail me, actually. I see. Who's involved? Alamu Nethri in town, and uh, another dark elf that I found in Frozen Grotto. I think his name was Nedim? I see. Well, I think it's about time I had a little chat with this Alamu Nethra. In fact, why don't you come along? You reported it. It's only fair that you're present for this. Ah. Uh, I, I, I don't- I don't think that that's a good idea- Alright, fine. She's going to have my hide, probably. You must be well used to the, uh, the altitude around here. You're much faster than I am. Ugh. You you are aware of the uh, the werewolves around here, right? Oh, whoops. I guess I guess we're cutting through here. All right then. By the way, I don't actually know what they're smuggling. For the record. But it feels like... Th this is the pack, right? I, it feels like bottles of skooma. But I can't be 100% sure. So, uh, if, um... If it's not, then, uh... Right, um... Excuse me, fox. That fox has been up here twice. You, uh... Would you get out of my way? Underfoot. Oh, great. Wait, 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 wait. I, I'm coming. You're just, you're fast, and I can't keep up. Hey. Oh, we're back here again. Is she in there? And how do you know? <sighs> well, we're back in Bruma. Huh? Yes, officer? Is there something you need? Yes. You. In irons. Ooh. I'm sorry. Damn Waste no time. Sort of Damnable mistake. owner! How dare he allow There's that no lizard mistake. to engage in such a slave Unless the blackmailing display. of this gentleman here was Scandalous. some sort of huge misunderstanding. I, I assure you, this is all... Something makes me think you can't explain all the correspondence and contraband we already discovered in your home a while ago. Oh. As thanks for reporting the smuggling ring to us, I'm authorized to dispense a small token of our gratitude. Be well, oh, Susan. Small. Hey, just looking down in the in cellar. We're out of greenwood mead still, it looks like. We've what? been out for a week now. What's going on? Well, that was a... Uh... I wrote the order up ages what ago. Is it? That was interesting. down our courier. As soon as we get someone to deliver it, the mead should start flowing again. What are these? I see. Well, let's hope the courier turns up sooner Resume rather than pamphlet. later. 
That's not that interesting. Your view notice, dear customer, welcome to the Erin Bruma and Old Tamriel. You are in need of a room, please to speak to. Yes, of course. That, um. That does follow. Right, okay, I'm, uh. I'm running low on food, actually. Hmm? I'm going to need a room for the night. I do not fancy camping out again. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. What is it? If I ever see. Your companion again, I'm going to slit his throat, I hope you know. Excuse me, you're the, uh, you're the baker. The name's Yotra. I keep the place clean and tidy for our customers and guests, and cook the fine meals that we're so renowned for. Right, I, I would actually like to, uh, to purchase some so of those fine meals. So, what will it be? Um. I've got food and I've got drink. Let me show you what we've got. Right. Um. I will take some ale and a beer. I'm feeling in dire need of a drink. I will take that eyebrow off your hands. I do have rather a sweet spot in my heart for that. Uh, mud crab stew. I'll take the salmon. Um. See you around. And you as well. Thank you very much. Uh, well, it's getting on to be, uh, be evening I'm here. I'm proud of my ancestry, as should all Nords be. Oh, hello, Aurelia. How are you today? Uh, do you mind if I sit here? Uh, hmm? I, I'm assuming no. Talk to you later. Right. The Gerald View is quite an agreeable venue. So, what can I play for you? Um, Can nothing right you? at the moment. I'm- I'm fine. I just need some food. And a drink. Uh, excuse me. Welcome to the Gerald View. What can I get you? I'd actually like to rent a room, please, if that's alright. Ah, you did well to choose the Gerald View. Your room rental also includes complimentary access to the Gerald View bathhouse on the lower floor. Peruse it at your leisure. Our customers find it very rejuvenating. <laughs> you mean the... Uh, just here. Come, I don't actually remember who I saw down there last time. What is but it? right at the moment, I don't oh, particularly... I can barely hear to myself thinking here. Service. I'm no Nord, but I'll keep drinking meat until I become one. <laughs> Greetings, I'm Ombre. Ombre the right. Bard. Alright. Uh, Stantus, are you okay? You, uh... You, um... You, you alright there? That was... I think you probably saw a spider in the rafters or something. Let me know Same if there's room? anything else you need. Same room. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Right. We've got to get this armor off. Fits quite nicely, but uh, I'm not much of a uh, pardon, pardon me. I'm I'm not much of an armor smith. I probably could have done a better job with um, with some proper equipment. All right, I'm still carrying that that hood that I, I probably should sell that at some point. Right, let's take that backpack off. Um, still carrying that iron armor. That's a little awkward. And I don't really need to keep the swords on me. So, that'll do. If you want food or drink, I can show you our menu. No, I'm printed on only the finest parchment for your hands and your satisfaction. Right, no, I'm I'm fine. I'm just gonna go find the bathhouse because Yeah, I need one. I need a bath. Man, this armor is really bulky. For light armor, and there's that odd Argonian again. Uh, 
that's a little better. It's actually quite nice, actually. Long day of killing things. Is he coming over here? This water is delightful. Truly delightful, yes? Delightful waters, no? Um. Would be a true shame should they be sullied. Um. Greetings. Um. I'm Albecius of the Ducani family. Yes. Uh. Do you know this Argonian by any chance? He's a little, uh. interesting. Yes, Traveller? What do you need? Uh, you mentioned the, um, the Ducani family. What exactly... It We're quite old and quite influential. When we say things, people, important people, tend to listen. Oh. That's not to say that we're the Elder Council, but we don't tend to be ignored either. Right. And that's not to say we don't pick up on new opportunities when we can, of course. Our family must always strive for bigger and better things. <laughs> Not to sound like a priest of St. Martin. <laughs> oh, of course, of course. Um, uh... So your name carries weight. What about you, in particular? I am privileged to enjoy quite a comfortable life. But I do try to give something back to the less fortunate folk when I can. Of course. The Great War took its toll on us. On all, Cyrodiil. She may not look so different on the surface, but her spirit writhes in agony. No, I've, uh, I've certainly seen that. Farewell. Yeah, of course. It's quite nice, actually. I really hope... I don't think... I don't think that werewolf left any, uh, any scars on me that that healing potion didn't fix. Is that Argonian really coming over here again? Hello there. Really? All right, um, um, sir. Is there something uh, are, I can do for you? Are you what trying to flirt with need? me or something? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What do you need? Um, all right then. Ah, someone else who desires a relaxing bath, yes? Welcome to the bathhouse, fair patron. Um... So, to whom do I owe this pleasure? You're, uh... Uh, who are you, first of all? You're a little strange. Never answer a question with a question, friend. Bad form, or so the Imperials say. I call myself Bathes in Murky Waters. Though friends call me Bates, for I enjoy bathing in baths very much. These are dark times for the Empire, wouldn't you say? It still has not recovered from the Great War. And now, once again, it appears it will descend into turmoil. The Dominion are increasing their presence. And I hear rumors, whispers on the wind, of insurrectionist groups agitating against the current government. Some of the political families of Cyrodiil are even vying to place themselves upon the ruby throne. What say you to that, friend? Um... Are you sure we should be discussing that here? It is a public bathhouse, after all. Bats are relaxing, yes? Unwind the muscles, release tension. Surely the best place to have rational discussion about sensitive subject matter. Really? I have no idea. I'm not really one to discuss politics, really. I'm just an archaeologist. Ah, but friend, that is a fool's outlook. If you do not involve yourself in politics, you become a powerless spectator. Now, friend, tell me honestly. And remember, we are friends here, in this most innocuous of public places. What do you truly think of the Median Empire? 
I, I, I don't know what to tell you. Honestly, honestly, I think they betrayed us by bowing to the Dominion, but you didn't hear that from me. Frankly, you're rather creepy. No offense. They did what they had to do, given the circumstances. Perhaps they do, friend. But politics can be notoriously unforgiving. Do you truly believe they will be able to withstand this discontent? No, they cannot. And they will crumble. It is inevitable now. But the Empire is greater than its current median rule. And it cannot be allowed to collapse, no. There must be change, yes? There must be revolution. Do you not agree? I, I, why would you even ask me this? I'm not about to tell you my political allegiances while bathing, sir. This greatly saddens me. But time may change your political allegiances, no? You may yet stumble upon me bathing elsewhere when your thoughts are different, yes? And now, my friend, I must depart. I am sure we will see each other again. Gods, I hope not. Mara, save me from this bloody crazy Argonian.